Now, New York state authorities are planning to step up surveillance this time on school kids. The program, which is to be launched statewide, is supposed to gather information on students starting from the age of five. And as Artis Marina Portnow reports, the move is finding little support among parents. A new data gathering program in New York State shows that not even America's youngest citizens can be spared from having their personal information collected and stored. The Department of Education is creating a statewide database that will include the names, addresses, test scores, learning disabilities, attendance and disciplinary records of every single public school students. The data collection begins at the age of five and a private company called InBloom has been contracted to uh, store and protect the records of 3.6 million students. Education officials say the program can help companies who produce teaching material to tailor their products to student needs. However, parents are not buying it. More than 4,000 have signed a petition rejecting the InBloom program, including Karen Sproul, who spoke with RT about her concerns for her 10 year old son and millions of others. The New York State Department did not notify parents. They didn't give ask for consent. Um, we kind of just stumbled on it and discovered it. It just seems like parents were taken out of the equation completely in terms of protecting their children's privacy. Mm -hmm. um, we were not aware that um, the New York State Department made a deal with Bill Gates in Bloom nonprofit organization to upload all of our children's personal data. This includes the parents' data as well mm -hmm. um, uh, for the purpose of personalized learning. For me, this is particularly alarming because my child has special needs. Um, and his m school records are essentially his medical records. Mm -hmm. Whereas in any other instance, um, releases would have to be signed for any of that information to be released to mm -hmm. a third party. You don't even know who will have access to your child's records. If there's breaches, you wouldn't even know because it's so massive and the extent to the information that's being uploaded is so huge that it will be available to many different third party vendors and entities that we have no idea who they are and what information would be released to them. It's horrifying to me as a parent. New York officials say the In Bloom student data program will begin in April. In the meantime, thousands of parents say they are prepared to fight the state tooth and nail in order to protect their children's privacy. Reporting from New York, Marina Portnaya, RT.